Gotta say good evening to Alicia and Rhea. Hey. I say under thee. Okay, guys. Listen. You know when it comes to me and music, I can do this all night long. And I'm looking a little dark over here. I wonder how come. Eh. I'll figure it out another day. Let me try this and see if this will make a difference. Does that make a difference, guys? This this one's just a little dark, but... Anyhow, yeah, I know lighting expert, but we're getting this. So, guys, thank you for joining. Thank you for coming on. Uh, before we go any further, I just got to let you know that if you have a business that you like to promote um, and let people know exactly what you do in your business, hit me up. Send me a message, okay? I'm really trying to connect with... Um, the Archbishop of Louisville and I'll tell you when I finally get that yeah I'm trying to get some interesting people on here because this year hmm, I'm promising myself that I'm gonna be making some really good interesting activities happen alright guys so uh, apart from promoting the artists and letting you guys know who they are and the praise ministry that they've got going on the worship ministry um, that they have going on. We also want to let you guys know what's going on with reference to current affairs uh, So this might be um, hopefully finally that um, Prime Minister Mia Motley responds to my request to be on the show and if you guys know her personally you can say hey listen um, Prime Minister Motley We would like you and want to talk it off uh, We have some questions we want answered. It's gonna be a forum where you guys can do that I'm also trying to get uh, my other prime minister. So I've got two, I've got three, well, two prime ministers and a president, right? Uh, Roosevelt Scarrett, who, who is in the heat of elections right now in Dominica. And uh, we're really trying to make some waves and get some activities going on there. All right, all right, guys. So Instagram, you guys have the ability to send this to your friends uh, as a message. And Facebook, you can share this to your page. I would really appreciate it if you share it to your page. Now, here's the other thing what I've been doing. I have had a dormant uh, YouTube page for a couple of years. Yes, I said it, a couple of years. And finally, been promoting it. So when you get the opportunity, it's called the C2 Project. So just type in the C2 Project. You'll see that green and black emblem there that you can uh, see the videos and identify. You will see videos when I had my internet radio station in there. And uh, we were interviewing Carlos Baptiste was uh, working with me then. Michael Trotman, Mikey was there with me. Um, also, um, Nisha Woods, uh, she she was a part of it there as well. So, you know, everybody had a somewhere that they started. And I'm so happy and so proud to say, hey, listen, these are some people that I had with me while we were developing. And, you know, as things grow and things get better and so on, we grow and we get better as well. So if you want to promote your business, let me know. You can send me a message. You can give me a call, 301-312-0363. I'll put it there as well so that you can give me a call. And if you would like to sponsor the entire show so where all we talk about is you, that is so easy. Listen, guys, to sponsor this show is affordable. So again, hit me up, okay? And I got to plug this in. Before I go any further, you got to get this in there and get it marinated into your souls as you speak. If you are in the Maryland area in the U.S. and you're looking for property, give me a call. My number is 301-312-0363. A whole bunch of threes in my numbers. Uh, I can help you there. I'm, a, I'm an agent with Real Broker LLC and we really do. It's a really great platform that um, where agents can actually work together in the cloud. So we work from anywhere in the U.S. And um, we are able to really work close together. They, they have great mentorships. These guys, you guys hear me quote quite often. Beloved, let us love one another for love is of God and anyone that loveth is born of God. He that loveth not knoweth not God. So beloved, let us love one another. Well, this group of people in, in Real LLC, Real Broker LLC, they actually exhibit that. They help, they share, they, they promote, they, they give, they, you know, they accept. And they're willing to help you develop as well. So if you're not, if you think you won't get a, a, a good deal because you're getting one agent, no, you're getting a whole bunch of real agents. All right. So let me know if you want to buy, sell, rent, lease. 
property, be it um, find long-term investments in your in property, give me a call. All right, guys. Okay, so let's get this show started. But before, let's get a little bit more Joseph Niles. And while we're doing this, I want you to invite your friends. Do what I'm about to do right now. Okay? I'm going to go invite my friends. best that you have. Give up your best to the master. Give up your best to the master. Give him the strength of your youth. Yeah, don't wait until things are just way down in there where you think you aren't able to do anything, but give up your best to the master, okay guys? I'm sharing this video right now to my page. Hi Adrian. Adrian loves the African look. So this is what Africa looks like, okay? I guess I've been rocking Africa for a number of years now, huh? Awesome. Thank you, Adrian. Sometimes I think we lose the memory of objective, of subjective things. So do what I'm doing right now. I'm actually sharing it to my page. Adrian, I'd love if you share it to your page as well. That would be awesome. And I'm going to invite my friends. Joseph Niles. Oh. Loving it. So I'm sharing it to my page right now. So I want you guys to do the same, okay? And I'm also inviting my friends. Yes. Okay, I'm going to do one more set of people. Loving it. <laughs> when was the last time you guys heard this? I want they're sinking a little bit. I'm having a good time. I'm actually worried about the lighting, but when I look at this, the lighting works fine. Hey, not so much of a worry. All right, so one of the things I want to do tonight, I need to get this music in here so that you you guys can actually hear it. Um, of who I'm going to be speaking to tonight. And by the way, Joseph Niles is from Barbados. He is no longer with us. He has gone to meet his father in glory. Yeah, God, God got tired of him being here. He wanted him all to himself. So celebrating that life. Okay, so we're chatting this evening with, now I gotta mute this because we can't be featuring two different people tonight, okay? As much as I love you, Joseph, 
Big Father Daddy Joseph Niles. As much as I would love to listen to that all evening long, we've actually got to uh, share the music of... Hold on, where did this disappear to? I know Brian sent it to me this evening. I played it. I listened to it. Ah, there it is. Whoop, there it is. I I know, I, I love music, so whatever it is. Once it's not too... <laughs> there was, what is it? I think it was Other People's Property. Um, Yeah, it's... It was one of those... One of those songs. Uh... How many know he's good? We're not ready. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Somebody say he's good. Come on. I was listening to this today. Can you hear me shouting? Yeah. Thomas. Yeah. Yeah. He's so good. Come on. You guys can hear this? Tell me yes. Amazing, beautiful. So we're just ra waiting right now for uh, Hey Ganesha or Janisha. Thank you for coming on. Bless up, big song. I agree, Orville. I agree with you. Okay, here now. Just trying to get um, Calandra on right now. Yeah, guys, invite your friends. So while we're waiting to see how we can add Calandra on, no, Calandra, if you can't get on on um, on uh, Facebook, we're going to add you on Instagram, okay? Either way, it's going to work out because we're going to get this done tonight. All right? And I'm going to get some of your views on tonight, okay? Hey, Maurice, thank you for joining us on Instagram. Bye. 
this big tune. Thank you for coming on, man. Thank you for having me. This is so, sorry, have a migraine, so working with it. <laughs> okay, guys. So we have the big tune singer right now, Kalanch. I love this. Thank you so much. This is listen to me. You know why I almost know all the words. <laughs> No, guys, so that you know, right? I only got this song this afternoon, so if you're hearing me singing like I know it, like it was oh, a year ago, this song is... I love it. Love Thank it. Thank you so much. So that not, is awesome. I'm not going to wear it out. Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to wear it out. The reason I'm not going to wear it out is I want you to tell them where they can get this song right now. Right now, you can go on iTunes. And get the song. It is on Google Play. It is on Amazon. Or you wow. can go directly to my website, www.calandra. Hold on. That's G www. C A L A N D R A G A N T C. Two T's. Uh huh. Two T's on there. Uh huh. Dot com. Um, you can go on there and and purchase it on my through my website as well. But it's on all digital retailers. Nice. And how much is it? Um, if you purchase it through there, it's only ninety nine cents. Nice. Ninety nine cents. What if we got so this single? Got so, so if if they wanted an autograph copy, how can they get it from you? Okay. If you would like an autograph copy, um, I need you to send me just send me a message um, on Facebook. Um, reach out to me on Facebook, Calandra Gant, the Princess of Prey. And let me know you were listening to this great show and you would like an autograph copy. Awesome. And I will, we can communicate and I will sign it and send it to you. So what about radio stations? Who, who, who has your song right now? Right now it is being played um, here in Atlanta. Um, Kiss 104.1 FM. That's a terrestrial station. Right. Um, it's on all of the internet stations. Nice. From, um, yeah. Yeah. So really, most of the internet stations that you listen to, um, they are playing it. Um, Sensational Sound Radio. Um, we we have played in Louisiana on um, gospel show, gospel radio show, um, with Little JoJo. So he's playing it, and that's in Kentucky. So we're very grateful, um, and it's expanding. It's getting larger and larger, and it's a great song. Right. Everywhere right. I go, people want me to sing that song. So listen. I can't get away with not singing that song. So let me tell you. Let me tell you what was going on when I was listening to this song. You know when you say so, um, and I know some people you don't don't get annoyed or upset with it because people don't like to mention other artists when you're talking about them. But uh -huh. the, the Anointed Pay Sisters have a song. Um, <laughs> Jesus loves me. This I know. Okay, you know that song. Y yeah. Um, so there's a yeah, part. There's yeah. a part of this song, right? He's better uh, than Campbell's soup. Oh, <laughs> mm -hmm, good. Well, this song. <laughs> this song. I know that song. Yeah. Look, this song. He's good. He's so good. And and that's just a reaction. You know, they. I tried to say. I tried. To, um, that was a, I was singing this song live and that was just something that just, I felt in me and I was in the studio and every time I sing it live, it's like, he's you can't so leave good. that part out because everybody's singing it. You know, everybody's saying he's mm, 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 good. I tell you. He is mad. So, but, but that's what I'm getting. It's, it's like, we know that God is good. Um, yeah. you know, you know, he, he, God is good. Oh, no, this is not God is good. No, God is good. He's so good. And this He's is, so good. this is that feeling you get from that song. Yeah. So I was like, oh my yeah. goodness. And I had to actually stop yeah. playing it earlier this afternoon. And then I said, okay, I need to be fresh here. Have my, my, my <laughs> new response. And then I, when I played it tonight, right. I was like, wait, hold on. This is a new response. <laughs> 
it'll it'll do that. I mean, this song it is the favorite of everyone. It right. is everybody's favorite song. It really is. So it's it's an album, correct? This actually um this is a remake of the song. Um I um originally did this song and it was a little bit slower, but then um when I started doing it live, it got a little bit more um energy in it. Okay. So it was like you need to re- you need to record that. So this is from my live project that um I'm working on, I'm completing up now in the studio. So this is from the live project called um, Praise, Worship, and Soul Experience. Right. Um, Live and all of the songs over the years that I've done, we've remade them and made them made a live version of them. Can I hear the Can I hear the slow version? Can I just give me a taste of the slow version? Um, it's it's the 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 rhythm is not as fast, but it's um, come on over where the table is spread. And see that he's good. So the rhythm of it, it's a little bit mid tempo. Yeah, and it's like you, you, you. Gonna, it's almost like you gotta, you gotta be. So it's almost like a two up. step, a one two step. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. But the slower version is it, it, it's a little bit slower, um, and it doesn't have the, the the like you said the instrumentation. Yeah. All of that is live instrumentation. I heard and, that. Um, it, yeah, and it was recorded in California, actually with the um, tri- Triset Sound mm-hmm. um, in California. He did a great job um, Beautiful. on that project, uh, on that particular song, and um, went in California, played all the instruments, the drum, the keys, and, and everything, just to get that live feel, and it turned out to be excellent. This was This was definitely excellent. And speaking of excellent, I, I really mm-hmm. think that God only called the most excellent of psalmists to do his work. Where, where does all of this start? This starts at the age of three years old. I think I was singing before I was speaking. Yes. You know, uh, I, wait, hold I, on. I, hold on. Just in case some of you don't believe this. My daughter was singing at, at six months. Come on. Come on. Go on. I, I I tell, um, I, 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 I kid with people all the time and tell them, I think I came out of the womb singing with them, but I've always, um, um, as I got, it started at the age of three and wow. then as I continued to sing, um, I started, um, playing the piano at the age of nine nice. and then we started, um, my grandfather, he's a singer and a piano player. He's like, he's 88. Wow. And he just stopped he just stopped playing last year. So he played all the way until eighty seven. Okay, wow. But I was just reading the comments here. Janisha, I hope I am pr- pronouncing your, your, your name right. Uh that's me. My dad said I sang before I talked. <laughs> so yeah, a lot a lot of people, yeah, it's yeah. it's really just developing the talent. But yeah, so you have that talent, but then where was it um, fertilized? How 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 was it, it fertilized? How was it nurtured? Through through church, I've always believed in being a servant. Mm-hmm. Um, um, and started in church. Uh, I've always always studied with my grand. He played for the church for seventy plus years, so I've always been in the church, um, studying under choirs. And so I started at a very early age mm-hmm. and got a foundation. Um, in the house of God about music and always attended chorus in school and and um, choirs in school, always right. studied music. Um, but I started directing at the age of 13 and, and, be, and still doing that now. And um, just, just it's, my nurture, the background came in church. It started right. in church. That was the foundation. So you've always been in church. Yes. Did, I've always been in church. Did you that, ever that step outside? To, did you ever step uh, out, did you ever step outside to sample the other instruments? Um as far as singing like secular music uh-huh. or anything like that. D- through college, because I went to a um I went to study college um um music education and I was part of a group. I've been part of groups. Right. And in those groups we sung music as long as it did not compromise our faith. As long as it was positive music, mm-hmm. because we would do weddings, we would do um, 
you know, just different engagements, but we never saw anything that compromised our faith or compromised what we believe in. Because I love all music. Right. I love all music. Um, God is the creator of all music. Um, I just think that some people take it to another level and we have to learn how to still make it uh, what it's set out to be and that speak to people. That's what music does. It's a language. Right. And it, and it speaks to people. So I have song. Um, I don't think I could make a career out of singing another style of music because that's not my calling. Um, but I love, I kind of incorporate sometimes even in my writing music from the old and I, cause I love reggae. I love Caribbean music. I love Calypso. I love, I love all styles of music. Right. Right. So then you were listening to some Spooge when I was playing it earlier, huh? Oh, yes. Yes. And yeah. I listened to um, one of your your, your uh, videos where you had Ricardo Clark. Yes. Yes. Don't count me out. I love that. I nice. love that song. Nice, I nice, love nice. That song. So... I want to go back to the to the just talking about with with you about being about praise and worship and and the work mm-hmm. that really goes into that. Um, yes. How how do you prepare for your for your music, your presentation, your ministry? How do you prepare to present? Um, the first thing I do, I seek God. Mm-hmm. Every every engagement that I have, because what I've learned is that every audience is different. Every audience is different. I call myself sometimes like a chameleon because praise and I, I grew up under traditional, contemporary, all of it. But I always seek God and say, you know, what is it that you would have for these group of people? Right. What is it that they need at this appointed time? And sometimes I go in with a plan. I have a band with me. And God will switch it up right, right there while, while I'm on stage and take it to a whole nother level. So I think, first of all, you have to seek God every time you are ministering to people. Uh, we're not entertaining. We're ministers yeah. who just happen to be artists. I agree. Um, that's, how I, that's how I look at it. And so we have to find what is the need at that time. And you have to be, people forget this. Because I know when we have singles out, we want to sing our single. We want But sometimes you can't sing your single if the spirit says sing something else. True. You have to be sensitive to the spirit. That's you very really true. do. That's very true. You have to be sensitive to the spirit and be okay with that to know that God will give you another opportunity. And and what I found is that when I'm sensitive to the spirit and seeing what he says, people still buy my single. Right. They still buy the music because of the the, the anointing yep. and, and what is being done that you you obeyed the spirit and and did what you were supposed to do. So God God, they still came. They still bought the single. They still loved it. Um, and, and you just have to, I, I say, you have to go in and, and, and see what your atmosphere is and, and, and be obedient to the spirit. I love it. I love it. So you're, you're, you're a worship leader as well at your church? Yes. Yes, I am. I've served, um, wow, over 30 years in my church. I'm still serving at this time as praise and worship leader. Um, musical director, I direct the choir right. at the church. Um, I serve as a um, youth minister, youth pastor. Um, I've done that for many years. So I'm um, Sunday school teacher, teaching the word of God and, mm-hmm. and um, preaching the word. So I, I truly believe you always need to um, be a servant. We are servants, you, you, and you have to be faithful to it, you know, because God, God honors your faithfulness. Yes. So I love what I do. I, I love um, setting the atmosphere because that's what worship leaders do. We set the atmosphere. We, we set the atmosphere. I'm a praiser now. I'm a hard praiser because um, I love going in and praise. Because praise has gotten me through a lot of situations. Praise has gotten me through a lot of situations. So yep. a, I love to praise God. I love to give him praise. He's so worthy. Oh my goodness, he is so worthy to be praised. I, I remember, you know, when you've gone through some really um, mm. heavy moments, you know, the, the Bible says that the Holy Spirit will interpret your utterances. And yes. I've yes. I've seen some people who are who would praise and would begin a praise and worship session and be speechless because they just they themselves have a heaviness and before the session is over they are able to open their mouths and yes. um praise and worship is one of the most interesting um 
not a weapon. Well, it's a weapon, but um, it, well, catalyst. It kind of is. Catalyst. Yes. I, I would okay. say catalyst. Great word. Yes, yes. I'm so glad to see all of my friends on here yeah, tonight. Yeah, they're coming That's on. Awesome. That's awesome. Yeah, they're coming. Well, I can't see all of them. I, I, it's, it's interesting how this operates, but um, <laughs> I can see, I can see some of them coming on, and that's, and that's yeah. really fantastic. Um, yeah, and I was just looking through some information on, on, on you. Well, basically, just your profile and stuff. And love your fashion, by the way. Love that yellow Thank outfit. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I gotta plug that in Thank there. Thank you so much. <laughs> Dr. Grant, good evening. Yes, I'll see you in October. Um, uh, yeah, so I, I, I saw that as well. Uh, but yeah, I, I really... Um, Ron Canoli, uh, you remember that song he has? Lord, make us instruments of your peace. Yes. And, yes uh, of your yes, grace yes. And, and, and of every, grace, everything. Yes. And it is good when people are allowing themselves to be used by God, you know, if you can use anything, it's, yes. it's, and I, I see this and I hear this in, in the same realm and, and path of, um, continued worship, uh, for decades yes. to come. Um, yes. so you said earlier that, um, full-time, uh, music ministry is, is not your calling. What is your calling? Well, no, actually, um, I never thought it was going to be my calling, but can I, can I tell you this? That's really all I'm doing now. I'm doing music. <laughs> and, 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 and I want to be very transparent and I want to be real with people. I try to do this is that you really have to know that this is your calling. Right. Because there's going to be a lot of sacrificing. I got laid off of my job like seven months ago. Wow. And I was like, okay, God, you know, I have a mortgage, I have all of this, and I have all of that, but, you know, and then I tried to get back into the workforce, and it just wasn't working. I was not, it, it was almost like in a battle. I was being pulled, because I kept looking at the natural, that you got to have this, you got to have that, but when, you, when you're truly walking in your calling, you really have to trust God. Right, and not and really and have to trust God. and what I what I find is when you said you kept looking at the natural, we we look at what we are accustomed seeing. Exactly. Until he exactly. opens our eyes up to realize, well, well, yeah, but because they're doing it, that doesn't mean that's how the way it's supposed to be. Yes. So yes. so and yeah. So on. Yeah. So true, and and so I um. And see, not only do I do music ministry, I, I teach private lessons to kids. I love to teach kids um, piano and vocal training. And, and so that's what I do now. I just go in and, and go into the schools and, and teach them um, how to play the piano and how to do chorus and how to do those vocals. Anything with music, I try to be involved with because that music is part of my life. It's, right. it's my calling. Well, I'm gonna drop one on you. You need to do some face, some some not some Facebook, some um, online courses, some live webinars. I do do it. I do. Oh well, praise God. Okay. Live webinars. All right. You know, hey, I'm, I'm doing a webinar, a such and such and such, and uh, come and learn. You don't even have to charge them. Trust me. When you give them one lesson, they'll come back and say, "Hey, I'll pay for this." Hey, that's yeah. a great idea. When. <laughs> He drops it. <laughs> he drops that it. Is a, that is a thought. That is a great idea. Because I'm right glad now, you. I I'm glad you thought of it. <laughs> I actually have a student who's in North Carolina, um, and I teach her over Skype. Okay, so there you go. It, 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 it's, it's, I mean, it's doable. I mean, voice lessons. Of course. Um, and I and I believe my gift will make room for me. Um, God has God has blessed me with all of this knowledge and all of this wisdom and all of these talents and gifts and I just believe that um he will it, he will open up doors where I can use those gifts and be able to live for him yeah and be able to still do ministry um because I've tried to get back into the I worked in the corporate world and if we know the corporate world it doesn't care about anybody. Um, no, it, doesn't. it really doesn't, and they they will let you go at the drop of a dime. I told people I've made six figures, I've made this, I've made less than six figures, but nothing gave me satisfaction.
passion besides doing what God called me yep. to. Yeah. And that's and that's the ministry and that's the music. Yeah. And so I know it's only for a season going through financial um, and I don't even call it a, a back, a setback because you're doing, and God is, when I say God will provide, yes, God provides yes. good. That's why I can sing that song because God is so, so good. good. He's so, so good. good. Man, yes, let me tell you, is. I can tell you some stories. <laughs> <laughs> I think, I think almost everybody on this earth, I remember when I was, um, like 13, 14, 16, even up to like 20, you would hear all these dramatic testimonies. And I'm like, okay, well, you know what, God? I'm glad I ain't got none of those testimonies because somebody might like, oh, I want one of those testimonies. And I was young. Like, I'm glad I don't have those. I'm glad you didn't pull me out of the dance hall. I'm glad you didn't pull me off of drugs. I'm glad you didn't pull yeah. me from a domestic yeah. violence. This. I'm glad right. this. I'm glad this. I'm glad this. I'm glad. I'm glad. <laughs> You know, hey. I mean, I've got my own story now. And, and, and you know, exactly. Leviticus, Leviticus said that he'll give us our own testimonies. All right. Yes. But, yes, yes. you know, I, I and our own experiences and, you know, it's similar to a, a number of other people, but I'm still glad that I don't have certain testimonies because right. when I hear the grief, I'm Ooh. like, yeah, I'm glad that wasn't me. Right, you know, right. and, and somebody Everybody, might go like, you know, yeah. but because he gives it to those who can bear it. <laughs> yeah. You know, <laughs> he knows us better than we know ourselves. So he knows you understand. what we can take. And the same thing with the talent. There are some people that have a number of talents yes. and they can handle yes. it well. There are some people that have one talent and they're excellent with it. You give them a second one, they mess up. Right, right, <laughs> so, you right, know, just, right. Just glad. He's good. He's so good. Yeah, I'm going to blast Isn't that song. Isn't he good? He's amazing. <laughs> He's amazing. Fantastic. I love it. I love that song. I, you have no idea how much that song ministered to me. It, it, Amen. Um, yeah. There, there, there are times you go like, oh, you know what? Where are you, man? I mean, are you real? I, in Why? this, in <laughs> this develop, in this stage of my Christianity. You will question because you may yes. teach others. You go like, like, I mean, there's so many things going on around you and you, you want to go like, listen, do you even exist? Yes. Because when I see this going on, I, I, it, even in your own little cocoon, you know, you mm -hmm. wonder like, mm -hmm. like what's going on? And then he shows up. He shows up. And he doesn't. And you know what? Yes. He shows up right on time though. But but the other thing is too that some people may go like you know for years and years and years, missing the the, the the short times that he showed up, so they didn't see when he showed up last week, a week before, a week before. They only remember the big one that he showed up five years ago. <laughs> you know, but I'm reminded that he shows up, and he shows every up day. every single time. He is God is every so day. good. He is this, every day. This song is the new, this song is the new God is good all the time. All the time. God is good. No, this is, uh, yeah. this is God is so good. Full stop. So good. <laughs> <laughs> no, all the time. And all that. So we got some people joining us here right now. Let me see who's joining. Amen. We've, we've been in our conversation. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. So Octa oh, Octavia music. Listen, I got to get you on the show sometime. Octavia. So Octavia is from Barbados. Uh, she's okay. on Instagram. So so we are on Instagram and Facebook Live at the same time. Uh, awesome. Maurice joined us. Trisha joined us. And Octavia just joined us. And David just joined us. Uh, we have a couple of people on, Inst on Facebook as well that just joined us. Guys, you're awesome. Remember to share this video and let Calandra know your love and understand yes. that other people don't need to know how good God is. It just, it's yes. just... This is one of those songs. Mm, 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 good. <laughs> yes. And if you want an autograph copy now, you got to message me with your information so I can send it to you because Correct. I will do it. I will do it. But you got to send me a note and say, you heard me on this awesome show. Yes. And we'll, and we will get it. Share the video. We will get it out too. Thank you, Janisha. Janisha just shared it. Janisha, am I pronouncing your uh, name right? Is it Ganesha or Janisha? Just say yes or no. Janisha? 
It's Janisha. Okay. She, yeah, she's one of my background singers too. Okay. Yeah. So she's yes, one we of went to college. Yeah. Yeah, we went to college together. So she's um yeah, she's one of my sorors. We part of a music fraternity and um she's okay. an awesome. She's an author as well. She's an author, great great woman, great woman. All right, Janisha, you need to drop the name of your book and where we can find it on there right now. Yeah, she Yep. Kalandra don't mind sharing the space, I promise you. I don't I'm telling I you. I don't. And if she minded sharing the space, I would I would fix her. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, guys. So so you heard this. You can get it on Amazon, iTunes. Brian just came in. He just came in. Amazon, iTunes. Um, what is it again? What is, where are the others? Uh, Google. Um, Google and you can is, go to my website. You yeah. can go to my website. But it's on every digital outlet you can dream of. Um, um, but www.calandragant, that's with two T's, dot com. And you can reach me on any type of social media, but if you want an autograph copy, you got to message me. I need you right. to message me on Facebook and I will get that out for you. Okay. So I just pinned that to the top there so that people can get to it a lot easier. Okay. Yes. So tell me what, what are the singles you have? Uh, what other, is, uh, do you we have another one of the singles from the live project entitled Love, and mm -hmm. that basically talks about how Jesus died on the cross for us. Mm -hmm. um, and it's the upbeat. It's a two-stepper. It's a two-stepper as well, because uh, our next single we're working on is going to be a worship song. Okay. So we have two two upbeat songs out right now, Love, entitled Love, um, and He's Good, that we're pushing from the live project. So but, um, I got I got to pause you there just to let you know that some badges are coming on right now. So Barry Reed in Barbados is listening as well. Hi Barry, he's on Instagram. Hey. Are you going? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, but we have a collection of music out there because we started back in um, 2003. So we have music mm -hmm. all the way from there. But the latest music we have, because our, our and it's so funny when you start. <laughs> Your, your actually your ministry changes over the years as right. you go through yeah. things, and so now we're at this whole different type of level in God. So right now, if you pick up Love, it's out there on digital retailer, and our single "He's Good," which is one of the favorites, right? Um, and and you would you would love it. You're gonna love both of those songs. I I I love this one, and I can only imagine better things, um, more excellence coming from it Amen. seriously Amen. um when you when you have that that quality to begin uh, there's no way you can go backwards oh no you there's should not go backwards no way. absolutely no you way. should not go bear it god god requires us to operate in a spirit of excellency yeah. i always tell people that a spirit of excellency yeah this was awesome <laughs> I don't even know how to, and I just want to put the music back on it. I say, or right, sing along to it, and and, and you know, but Sorry. no, we're not gonna do that. So tell us again where we can, <laughs> guys. You're gonna wrap up. I, I don't want to talk about anything yes. else. I want you to to just hear this, focus on it. Hold on. So Janisha uh, finally put her 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 song her book on. So the Commons, my life in a dream, and Imani, my life in a dream are on Amazon, or you can send thirty dollars plus five dollars shipping and handling to her cash app and she will autograph and send it to you at um at dollar sign janisha morton and uh, you can actually just uh click on it there and um, actually can i pin more than one comment is it gonna lose the two is it gonna lose the uh um, you pinned it you did it pin both both of them are pinned oh i don't i don't know uh hold on i think it unpinned the other one yeah oh no it's still Oh yeah, it unpins the. So other I one. yeah, so I pin, so I pin it back. Right, so that yeah, we gotta share one thing at a time. But Janisha, I'll tell you what, come on here and talk about your book. That's what you should do. All right. Amen. Amen. Seriously, this is. Amen. I'm trying to create a platform. So so this is why I wanted to talk. Um, the show is called One to Talk It Off, and I was just on Saturday. I was talking <laughs> to a colleague, and I wanted to be controversial and. You know, talk about this and talk, and I try to bend it. I try to, I try my best. So I want to talk about, you know, what, um, how are people receiving this and blah, blah, blah. I don't care. It's, it's, there's no need to, 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 to feed the crave of, 
that's um, right. of 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 chaos, discord, negativity, mm-hmm. hate, mm-hmm. and and mm-hmm. there's. I'm a modern day hippie. Love, man, love. <laughs> So, it's all about the love. You know, so I, I keep love. trying. I keep trying to, to be this, testy, pesty kind of. But I mean, but so so. What about nah? It's I'm good. I'm happy. Just I'm happy. be you. I tell people all the time. Just be the best you you can yes. be. That's it. Be genuine. Be authentic. Yep. Be who God called you to be. Because because you're needed in the kingdom. Yeah. That's that's how you have to look at it. Yeah. I mean, we gotta. We gotta. We got. We have to. Put some smiles on some faces and, and let people yes. know that we serve a good God. An yes, awesome, we do. omnipotent, omnipotent, merciful, Nissi, Emmanuel, Elohim, Jaira. Always. Yes. Always. Yes, always. We well. We do. We do. All right, guys. So Amazon, iTunes, and Calandra Grant. I can't be a Grant. Pronounce it Gant. <laughs> G-A-N-T-T. Yes. Uh, mm-hmm, dot com. Mm-hmm. You can go and get your 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 CD on there. It's ninety nine cents, um, so that you can yep, the single play it in your ear, play it on your your phone, hey. play it in your car. Hey, hey, that's the yes, song. Play yes. it in your ear, uh, play it in your phone, <laughs> yeah, know, play you it did. in your car. <laughs> hey. Oh, right, 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 right. But I'm, I'm so grateful for this opportunity. So thank you so You're much welcome. for having me on You're tonight. welcome. Thank you so much. She's wrapping it up. <laughs> No, I'm just. No, I'm no, no. Be, I always tell people you, you have to be grateful. You have to. No, be no, no. Grateful. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, but we we do need to we do need to wrap up. I uh, supposed okay. to end at nine thirty. Um, uh oh. <laughs> kids' bedtime is gone. Uh-oh. But guys, thank you for joining us. I remember to share the video, thank share, 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 send it to your friends, um, and tell them about next week. We'll have another special guest, and during the week, make sure you share it as well. Thank you, Kalandra, for joining us. Thank, Thank you. you for he's so good. It's amazing. Yes. And there's Thank only you. there's only really one fitting way to really end your interview. <laughs> See you guys. Bye bye. Thank you. One, two, talk it off. Hey, one, two, talk it off now.